The Officer Candidate School at Quantico, Virginia, molds college graduates into hardened leaders. Two and a half months of intense physical training, academic instruction, and leadership exercises prepare the candidates for difficulties found both in the Corps and in life. Now, one of these trials will come a little earlier than expected with the Monford Point Challenge. The Monford Point Marines, the first black enlisted men in the Corps, were recently awarded the Congressional Gold Medal for overcoming adversity in an all-white Marine Corps while contributing to the war effort during World War II. The Monford Point, um, the, the, the blacks in the Second World War was a company, uh, no one recognised them um, for, for all their hardship they went through. Uh, basically their job was to ammo resupply, um, any resupply that was required on the front line, they were tasked to do that. Candidates had to negotiate a three and a half mile course designed to simulate the physical demands the Monford Point Marines met, carrying 60 pound ammo cans, 150 pound stretchers, and 300 pound logs. OCS instructors designed the course to reinforce classroom instruction with hands on activities. They get to experience you know, the hardship and, and, the, and endure the, the physical you know, duress, and they get to um, work as a team together to accomplish you know, that, that mission that they're tasked with. Future officers can plan to undergo this event during week nine of OCS, as it is integrated into the official curriculum, deepening the legacy of the Montford Point Marines. Reporting from Quantico, I'm Lance Corporal John Tucker.